Squarespace is a fantastic website building platform that does a lot of amazing things. Unfortunately, their search functionality isn't known for being a robust. That's the nicest way I can think of to phrase it. Their search feature works really well for finding content inside blog posts and referencing tags and categories, but it's not so great at indexing content in specific types of page sections, and it definitely can't handle typos. Lucky for us, there is a Squarespacer in our community named Felix who was determined to find a solution. So determined, he created one, Monocle Search, which is an incredible Squarespace plugin that takes the functionality of your search feature to the next level. Here's what makes it so awesome. Monocle Search references all text on your site for its search results, even inside image captions. Yes, image captions can be triggered by a Monocle Search and show up in search results. Now, Monocle Search is also great for people that have products. It can show a list of content in your store relative to the search, and people can even filter by category right there in the search interface. Now, Monocle Search can also handle typos. I can even show previews of member content. Let's say you have a really fascinating blog post inside the member area of your site. If it's relevant to a search, Monocle Search will show just a little snippet here and mention its members-only content. It's like a built-in upsell right there in your Squarespace website. It's also incredibly easy to implement, and that's why I'm recording this tutorial. It is a fantastic plugin that I am so excited to implement on InsideTheSquare.co. So as I add it to my website, I wanted to show you what that looks like. As someone who's been working with Squarespace for years, I genuinely get excited when I find really cool tools that make your website work better for your visitors, and Monocle Search is one of those tools. It's affordable, it's user-friendly, it's easy to add, and it solves a real problem that many of us face. Now, of course, I wish that Squarespace would just step up and work on this feature, but they are doing a lot of things behind the scenes, and until this is a priority for their development team, Monocle Search is a fantastic solution. So I'm going to go ahead and share my screen with you and I'll show you exactly how easy it is to add Monocle Search to your Squarespace website and then I'll show you what the search results look like. Here we are at Monocle Search. You'll find my affiliate link underneath this video. I'm just going to click register on the top right hand side of the screen and we'll register for an account. I'll go ahead and use my hello at inside the square.co. We'll add a password. And for how did you find us, I'll add inside the square, but you don't need to mention that if you're using my affiliate link. Then we'll select create account. And here we are inside Monocle. Let's go ahead and add my website. Under URL, I'm just going to enter my full domain inside the square.co and I'll select start trial. Monocle starts with a free 15 day trial. The next thing we need to do is copy and paste this code into our website. I'm going to click this icon right here. You'll see it changed to a plus sign, and that means it's time to copy the content. Here inside Squarespace, I'm going to select Pages. Then I'll scroll down to Website Tools, and then we'll select Code Injection. Our Monocle search code is going to go in the footer section of our code injection. I'm going to highlight this right here, the footer section. That part's very important. Paste the Monocle search code right here and select Save. Now, Monocle Search has been added to my site. That's literally it. It's been added to my site. Back here in Monocle, our next to-do is to add this search link to our website, and I will show you how to add this to the header of your website. However, I want you to know that if you already have a search bar on your website, that content block type, that will function with the Monocle plugin now that we've added that code. It's directly connected to Monocle already. And if you visit your domain forward slash search, that's also going to work directly with the Monocle plugin. You don't have to do anything else. But let's go ahead and hop back into Squarespace and add this to our main navigation. Here in my Squarespace website, I'm going to click the plus sign next to main navigation, and let's add a link. I'll go ahead and use the little search icon, and I'll say search. Actually, let's capitalize it like all of my other links. There we go. And for the URL, I'm going to list forward slash search. Now, personally, I'm going to toggle off Open in New Tab. I want the user to stay on the same page. We'll go ahead and select Save. And let's go ahead and pull this down so it's actually the last link in our website. There we go. Now, I'll open up an incognito tab and we'll visit InsideTheSquare.co. When we click on this, it will open up Monocle Search. 
Now, if you have a large site like I do, you're going to see this alert that says, Welcome to Monocle Surge. It's currently being crawled and indexed. It might take a little bit of time. For smaller sites, it'll just take a minute or two. If you have a larger site like mine, it might take a little bit longer. I'm going to go ahead and pause the recording, and we'll come back when Monocle is ready to see what it looks like. All right, it's been a hot minute. Let's check this out, my friend. I click on search and immediately we see the monocle sidebar. Let's go ahead and type in landing page and we can see so much content showing up here. We're not just seeing my tutorial for landing pages. We're seeing my blog posts. We're seeing my podcast episodes. We're seeing so much information that talks about landing pages available on my website. Even my Squarespace glossary is listed. Again, monocle search will review all of the text content on your site which means it's even looking into transcripts from my podcast episodes. How cool is this? Now, I do want to mention we're seeing a lot of bright yellow, which is the default for Monocle Search, but that doesn't quite match the brand colors that I'm using on my website. So let's go ahead and go back to Monocle Search so I can teach you how to customize it. Back here in Monocle Search, make sure you select your website. And on the left-hand side, you're going to see Design. When you click on Design, this is where you can change the interface placement. Have it be on the left, center, or right. And you can adjust the search overlay. And my favorite part, the colors. Now, it has the WebSafe color name Transparent, but I'm going to go ahead and change that to this light gray color that I love to use. And then for the accent color, I feel like this will match my brand a lot better. Here we can also see a little preview of the search results, and you can determine how much context you want to show with each link. Personally, I'm going to go with short context. And last but not least, you can choose to show the description or hide the description so it only shows the excerpt from your site. I like the descriptions. I think it's helpful, so I'm going to leave that feature turned on. One last time here in Monocle, when we were looking at my sites, we selected inside the square.co where we just added the code. And on the left-hand side of the screen, choose the design option. This is where you can choose the interface placement, what the overlay presents like, change the color of the overlay, your accent color, how much content you want in the results, and whether or not a description should be shown. Underneath this video, you'll find my affiliate link to sign up for Monocle Search. Using my affiliate link means I'll receive a small commission if you do sign up for their paid program at no additional cost to you. But that commission helps support me and my content so I can continue to make free tutorial videos for our Squarespace community. So thank you for your support. Again, you'll find that affiliate link underneath this video. I hope that you're excited to give Monocle Search a try. I hope that someday Squarespace is able to do all the amazing things that this plugin can do. But until that day happens, thank you to Felix and the team at Monocle Search for creating such an amazing plugin. I'm very excited to see this work on my own website and really excited to see Squarespacers around the world elevate their site with this new feature. Thank you so much for watching this video. I truly hope that you found it helpful. If you're giving Monocle Search a try, let me know in the comments, what do you think? I'd love to hear from you and get feedback from the rest of the Squarespace community. And most importantly, my friend, have fun with your Squarespace website. Bye for now.